there's like a piece of hair on me. Do you ever get it when like you think that it's like a spider and it's just like, ugh, but you can't find it? I just found it, so we're okay, but like, it's the worst feeling in the entire world because I'm a hoarder with a problem. So I thought I'd... everybody it's your girl Jay and today I'm here with another unhaul video I have been getting rid of books left right and center recently just because I have absolutely no room on my shelves anymore because I'm a hoarder with a problem so I thought I'd share them with you before I send them off to the thrift store so without further ado let us get started the first book that I have is Cool Crown by Victoria Aveyard. This is the novella short stories of the Red Queen series. It's Queen's Song and Steel Scars. Steel Saga, Steel Some, I think it's Steel Scars. But I ended up giving this book a three out of five stars. I really enjoyed The Red Queen. I haven't picked up the rest of the series yet, but I figured I could read this one since it follows characters from the first book. But yeah, it was very underwhelming to me, so. I'm getting rid of it. Next book on my list is Extras by Scott Westerfeld. This is the fourth and final book in the Ugly series. I read the first part of the trilogy a couple months ago and I think I gave the first one 3.5 and then the rest after it three stars. I gave this a three stars. If you guys have followed my channel for a while now, you know that if I give a book three stars or less, it goes to the thrift store. So that's what's going on with this one. I didn't end up keeping any of the Ugly series just because I didn't really feel a point of keeping only the first book since I gave it 3.5 and not keeping the rest of them. So I just got rid of all of them. But I finally read the fourth book, so we're getting rid of that one too. The next book I'm getting rid of is Infinity Sun by Adam Silvera. I haven't actually read this book yet. This is an ARC version of it, but here me out. I ended up getting a finished copy of it from one of my subscribers. They sent it to me, so I figured I might as well get rid of the ARC. I think I'm gonna end up giving it to my friend Nicole because she's a reader too, and I usually give my ARCs to her because, you know, don't give ARCs to thrift stores because you're not supposed to because you can't sell them. So I usually just send them her way if she's interested. So that's what's happening with this one. I'm probably gonna get rid of the finished copy too when I read it because I'm assuming that I'm going to not like it because I honestly have not seen a positive review for this book so I'm a little bit nervous picking it up. I'm planning on picking it up soon but like I said, have not heard some good things about this book. The next book I have is The Need by Helen Phillips. I was really disappointed in this book. I think I gave it a two out of five stars. I thought of that it sounded so cool. It's like this mother who has like these two little children and then there's an intruder in her house and she like confronts this intruder. And I thought it was gonna be like a really cool psychological thriller, but it ended up being something really weird that I just didn't understand at all. And I don't know if that's because I'm not smart enough to understand it or if like I just, I'm not on the same wavelength as people, but like I did not like this. I was not a fan. So like I'm not really upset about getting rid of it, but I am because like I love the cover. I just think it's so like intriguing, but it was terrible. So yeah. Next one I have is Given to the Sea by Mindy McGinnis. I gave this a two out of five stars, I believe, which I was really disappointed in because this author wrote Female of the Species, which I love. I gave that book a 5 out of 5 stars. But I have heard that each of her books are very different from each other. I also read This Darkness Mind by that author, and I think I gave that one a 3 or 2.5 out of 5 stars. So I don't know if it was just a fluke that I loved The Female of the Species so much or what, but yeah, was not a fan of this one. Next, I have Jay Asher's What Light. This is like his Christmas book and it was fun while it lasted. I think I gave it a three out of five stars but like nothing amazing, nothing memorable so I don't need it on my shelf. Next is Black Wings Beating by Alex London. I think I gave this a three out of five stars. It was again fun while it lasted but nothing memorable so off to the thrift store. And then the final book that I have for this unhaul is Come Again by Robert Webb. I gave this a three out of five stars. I enjoyed it while I was reading it but again, nothing special, nothing memorable. Apparently that is the theme of this video. So again, off to the thrift store goes. All right, everybody, so that was my unhaul video for this time around. Let me know down below if you guys have read any of these books and what you thought of them, and I will see you all in my next video. Goodbye!